My name is Shuri Cade and I am a project manager for the JEEP program, okay. which is the Global Export Accelerator program. It's run by the PMTB, the Peter Maritzburg Chamber, okay. and ETIA for KZN, the Economic Development. And the aim of uh, today is to give the Jeepers, we've got 60 businesses in the program, okay. that we are preparing to export overseas. So helping them get their products to standard um, and licensed and certified so that they can start exporting. And the aim of today is to start their practicing of how they would showcase their products, how they would set them up, um, what it would look like, how they would engage with people, so that they can start thinking about what the best way is yeah. to engage with businesses and to negotiate deals and those kinds of things. So today's like a practice run. How, uh, what's the kind of range that you have here? What the kind of entrepreneurs that you are help, you're helping? Give us a variation. So all of the businesses have a product that is uh, ready or can be exported. So there's no service businesses um, or product businesses, but the range is diverse from clothing to accessories to food uh, to agricultural products to cannabis products to uh, candles and strapping and uh, even foam adhesives, uh, a wide range of products. Okay, so basically where can we find information? Others who haven't been part of this how can they participate, um, the works? So the program is run over a two year period. So this is the first year of this run. So at the end of next year, we'll put out a call. Everything's put out through EDTIA and through um, the Peter Maritzburg Chamber website, the PMCB website. So any updates that you need will be found on either the Facebook pages or their websites. So I'm telling you, first is a little bit what is it? What inspired the design? And what's written on it? Yes, it's my Oh, okay. It's a kimono that you can use traveling. You can dress it up and down. Depends yeah. on you what is it exactly that you want to use it for. But now it's you embodying the self, yes. who yes. you are. Yes. Okay. We are selling heritage and tourism, you know. Yeah. And we it's actually lined as well, we line it as well, okay. so it's for day or night. Do you have a move when you go visit? Who is it? 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 You know, since we have to move to this owning who we are, it's because we have lost ourselves along the way. Yeah, a lot of the things that we want they're so westernized. Yeah, and we want what we do. We want to custom make our own gifts. Identity. Identity. Yes. Yeah. And we can also give people from abroad, our relatives, our friends. Yes. And we have an online store where you can send your order through. We customize what exactly you need. It's mm -hmm. either the, the heritage, whether clan names or Bible verses, or the route, whatever, tour area that you want yes. to visit. All right, so where can we find you and, and what kind of range do you guys do in this kind of print? Uh, in terms of range, uh, yeah. we start from 350 rands uh, from the cushions okay. up to 650. But then we also have coasters, a set of four, you can get them for only 80 rands. Okay. Yes. We also do sleepwear. Sleepwear ranges from 600 rands. Male and female? Male and female. Nice. Okay. Up to 1,001 for males. Where can we find you? Where are you based? Okay. We have an online store. Okay. It's www.upcreations.africa. Okay. okay. Yes. Or you can WhatsApp us on 064 504 Double one seven five. My name is Bella Zondi, okay. and I'm the CEO and founder of Kenai Engineering. Okay. And Kenai Engineering is a manufacturer of quality powerline hardware. Okay. So these are your components that ensure safety and efficiency on your utility lines, your electrical lines, your rail lines, and your telecom lines. All our components are hot dipped, galvanized to protect against corrosion and um, to extend life. Because obviously, for um, utility lines you need you know components that are going to be there for a long time durability. and we are yes durability we based in number one with Ford Road here in Peter Maritzburg in Mason's Mill and how I got into the sector was basically um, 
I used to just do uh, general supplies and I once had clients that were looking for car line hardware and they could not source it from anywhere okay. and that's how I discovered there is a market for it and I've been in this business this is my third year in this business yeah and how is it how is it um, as a female and as a sector itself how is it treating the you? steel sector is still relatively male dominated yeah uh, white male dominated yeah uh, but with the quality that we um, produce and the turnaround times that we try to uh, adhere to yeah. I can tap into those markets and secondly most bigger established companies that are doing what we're doing yeah. sell in minimum uh, quantities so they won't sell you in for like five items or ten items they'll say at least you have to buy a minimum quantity of a hundred or a thousand yeah. so I try and um, capitalize there especially with um, uh, independent contractors so the independent contractors are more are my biggest clients right now yeah. so these are the guys that would generally get work from ESCA mm. or from your municipalities and they're sourcing uh, different components for the utility line so they will come to us and we supply them so some of them they don't get really long lines maybe they're doing renovations after damages or just a very short line and they don't really require that much of material yeah. So I can, I, I, I sort of play there where I can, you know, capitalize the su supplying smaller uh, quantities and we also customize based on what our clients are looking for, what they need. Anything generally uh, cut across the civil engineering sector that has to deal with steel. Try us. Thank you so much. <laughs> so this is Mangala Creations. Mangala Creations. Yes, we create and design beautiful, colorful, elegant, classic accessories using Ankara fabric. Okay. And beads. And beads. Yes. yes. So it's a juice up of a Zulu yeah. look. Yes. African. Classic. Yeah. Classic African. Okay. Yeah. So where do you wear this when you go to a job in July? Yes, definitely your big events like you saying Deb in July, your casual wear. Yeah. Then we've got as you can see we've got simpler ones that are not much if you don't that color. So we've got some dark colors for you which are mixed with gold of course. It can't be just dark. Yeah. So we also create something that is out of uh, uh, that is out of your thinking, yes. out of mind, out of the box. We are secure strap. Okay. okay. We are a textile manufacturer in Kitchmarisburg and Kondeni. Okay. What's unique about our product is we manufacture strapping that's used in the cargo securing industry. Yes. So diverse industry, sawmills, yeah. your timber mills, which yeah. use our strapping on their logs and their timber. Okay. Your steel industry, your steel mills, yeah. use the strapping to secure their coils. The okay. shipping industry in the shipping containers to secure your cargo in the containers when so it gets around. Anything that moves has to be secured. Yeah. All you have to decide is what's the weight of your load yeah. and we'll tell you what strength you need of lashing. What's and unique? You're, and you produce this. We're manufactured in Peter Maddensburg, okay. wholly manufactured, South African business, black owned. Okay. And what's unique is we allow the company branding on our strapping. Nice. So our customer can have their name, their telephone number. Mm. So when the truck is moving, your advertising is happening at the moment as well. Nice. And most recently, we're proud to be associated with the waste industry. Okay. Because all your bailing machines that secure or compress your waste okay. will be strapped to make sure that the loads don't expand. They don't expand. Yeah. So as I said, yeah. we, we are we extremely diverse. Okay. Our industries that we supply are diverse. Selling or marketing, we supply to resellers. Okay. So your packaging companies as distributors, yeah. as well as your larger end users. Uh -huh. Yeah. So I am Melissa Brown, actually the marketing officer of Siba Designs. Siba Designs. Yes, so this is from Siba Designs. Okay. We have ladies, we have all mama who do these. Um, yeah, it's honestly just whatever you feel like getting designed, yeah. whatever you put your you know, yeah. mind to and you like, I want this, yeah. we definitely can do that. And yeah, this is one of my favorites okay. and the mamas were like, yes, yes, we can. So yeah, this is what we do. Where do where can we find you guys um, as Siba Designs? So Siba Designs is available on all social media platforms. Your TikTok, 
Instagram is Siba.designs and Facebook as well, Siba Designs. We are also online, so you can just Google Siba Designs and our website is right there. Oh. Oh. You're feeling